this problem from tangential and normal acceleration of particle and the problem is a point moves in a plane curve so that its tangential and normal acceleration are equal and the angular velocity of the tangent is constant find the curve we have to find out the equation of the curve and it is given that tangential acceleration that is ft and this is equal to fn and what is ft and fn in plane curve we draw a rough figure let this is the curve at any point p this is the tangent direction and in which tangential acceleration act and this is the normal direction in which the normal acceleration act and we know that this is dvdt or this is v dvds or this is d2s by dt this three form of tangential acceleration and normal acceleration is given by v square by rho where rho is the radius of curvature and v is the velocity and let the tangent at p cut the x axis at p and this is the angle psi and here it is also given that the angular velocity of the tangent so the angular velocity of the tangent is given by angular velocity of the tangent is equal to psi dot that is d psi by dt the change of psi with respect to the time t this is the angular velocity and it is given that constant let it be omega this is constant okay we name this relation is 1 this is 2 and from 1 we get v dv ds this is equal to v square by rho and from this relation cancelling out v from both sides we get dv ds this is equal to v by rho and this gives dv ds this is equal to v into d psi by ds and this gives dv this is equal to v into d psi ok now we get from this relation dv by d this is equal to p psi and integrating this relation we get integration dv by d this is equal to integration d psi plus we take a constant this is log c and this is log d this is equal to psi plus log c that is log of d by c this is equal to psi that is d this is equal to c into to the power psi and we name this is 3 now let a this is the initial point on the curve and let the arc ap this is equal to s from a to p the arc is s so we write v this is equal to ds by dt this is the expression of velocity and from 3 we get v this is equal to ds dt and this is must be equal to c into e to the power psi ok we get this relation from 3 now we write ds dt as ds d psi into d psi dt this is equal to c into e to the power psi and from the given relation 2 we know that psi dot this is equal to d psi dt this is equal to omega and it be constant so we write ds d psi into omega this is c into e to the power psi so ds this is equal to c by omega into e to the power psi into d psi now taking integration on both sides we get 
this is another constant let it be b and this is equal to s this c by omega into e to the power psi plus b and we put another constant c by omega this is equal to a and we get s this is equal to a e to the power psi plus b and this is this is the intrinsic equation intrinsic equation of the given curve and this is our final answer okay thank you thank you for watching